over there we have the sun and over here we have me and i'm out here on a typical evening in the month of april and i'm gonna fly some planes because the snow has disappeared and we're having a really warm spell so uh, let's go fly this first one i have is called the neptune it's just a big wing and i'm about to plug it in and hook it up to my radio and then we'll take it for a spin and then after I fly this one, I'm going to fly a uh, glider, which is very relaxing. The sun has almost gone all the way down, so uh, should have some good flights. These will be really short. All right, so let's walk out to the field over here. Not too many people out at this hour. We have some folks over there playing soccer. There's a football game going on in that area. But uh, yeah, the sun's going down, as you can see it over there. And I've got the Neptune. You know what I'm going to do? So I'm going to put a little camera over here on the wing. Probably the wingtip over there, and we'll go from there. Oh, hang on a sec. I am I have a GoPro here. I've been talking with my hat cap, not even holding the GoPro. So there you go. Now you can see me. And there's the Neptune. Now, the Neptune is one of those planes that you hand toss to get it to go. And it has like a, a jet EDF. See, there's a prop in the back to push it. But there's no wind right now, so I don't know how this is going to go. Wish me luck. So this is the little Insta360 Go camera. I'm going to stick it over here on the wing. I've got some double-sided tape. You can see it. My worry is it's going to add weight to the wing, and we're going to thunder in a big crash right as I take off. Put in high rates. Arm the motor. Motor arm. Thank you. Since I have a GoPro over there, I'm just going to whip it way up in the air and uh, pray that she flies. Here we go. Low rates. Oh, I got low rates. High there, rate. I got it. All right, we got her. Now you should get some footage from the camera on the wing, I hope. And I'll also bring it down right out of my head so we can get a nice view of it. So flying planes for me is a really relaxing event. Unless they're crashing into the ground, not so relaxing then. I really love flying planes. It makes it uh, all the more enjoyable. Now I have lights on this plane. I forgot to turn them on. So let me bring them down and turn the lights on here. I'll uh, land it this way. I'll come from over that direction and bring it down to me. Here we go. Come on, right this way. Try not to hit the GoPro. And am I going to hit the GoPro? Whoa, just missed the GoPro. And I lost one of my lights. These are the lights I was talking about. You just buy them off of Amazon. I'll put a link below if you don't know which ones I'm talking about. I've got white ones. Oh, did I wreck it? Well, I've got one light that works. This one. <laughs> Try to get it up high, not to thunder into the ground. Whoa! I really got to work on my throwing. But I can see that one light. It looks pretty decent. There we go. Of course, you can't see it now. But here, let's bring it this way so you can see the wing. There you go. See the light? There we go. Now, if I had two lights, we'd be in business. Well, at least I know what the right wing looks like with the light going. So let me put it in high rates here and uh, flip it around a bit. Hi. There we go. High rates so I can do this. Crazy little stuff like that. Probably looks weird with the sun setting. Coming back. Try a loop. Sideways loop. Low. And put it back in low rates and bring it down towards me. Got my head, but here it is coming over me. Get down past that tree. And there we are. Cool looking plane. It's called the Neptune. It's by some company. I'll write right below what the company's name is. I got it from Motion RC. So I'll put a link to it below if you want to go check it out. All right, let's bring this baby back down. Got to slow it down, slow it down, slow it down. Go over the GoPro this time. There we are. Now I'll come around. There we go. Coming at me, here we go. Nicer landing this time. There she is. Look at that, just skimming along the ground. Nice. Okay, so the plan is now, I'm gonna go grab a different plane, a glider, which, uh, you know, there's not a lot of wind for a glider, but a glider is pretty cool because you put it up in the air and you just fly it around and then turn the motor on every now and then. So it's a lot of fun, especially in the evenings when the sun is going down. So let's go grab that now and put this one away. So the glider is down inside the bed of my Jeep. This is by E-Flight. It's called the Cassendo. 
evolution. This glider uses the same battery as this Neptune. So when I say the same battery, I mean the same 3S battery. I'm just going to yank it out of this one. So this Neptune with this battery, it's a 2200 milliamp hour three cell LiPo battery. I get uh, just over five minutes of flight time. So let's put a camera on this one as well. So this one here, I'll do the same idea. I'll put a camera way out here. It's going to weight down the wing. See, it's weighting it down already. So I'm going to have to compensate for that while flying. All right, so here we go back out to the field. Hopefully you get some shots of the setting sun. Well, probably won't see much, but anyways, this is fun. It's relaxing. As I say, it's always relaxing to fly at night unless you crash and then it's like, darn, what the heck happened? And then I'm gonna turn these lights on. Blinky lights, red and green. It's a very powerful motor, so here we go. There we go. Well, I can compensate for that easy. The camera weighs so little, very little compensation. So this is a glider. Motor's going, motor off. There we go. Now I can sit back and uh, have a glass of wine. See, I just got the joystick here. I could just, <laughs> there's not much I have to do. It just glides, 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 glides. It's so silent too. If anybody uh, was under it, they wouldn't even know there's a glider in the vicinity. It's so quiet at night. If you get it going fast, you can get a whoosh sound. A little bit of one there. Now, one thing I want to show you is the power of this glider. Watch this. When I want it to go up, watch. Up. She's gone like a rocket into the stratosphere. Oh, I can't even see it anymore. It's up there now. So now then you're way up there and you could just glide around. I tell you, on the late evenings, it is gorgeous. Here, I'll just do a full circle so you can get the whole skyline of what it's like up there. And as I mentioned before, the GoPro, uh, well, the GoPro that's on my head is not very good for night filming. So I don't think you'll see much. I'll go right over me here. No propeller, nothing. There she is, silent. Also flying gliders on a very sunny day is uh, super relaxing. Oh my God, in the early morning, if the sun is coming up and it's beautifully sunny, it's just so amazing. I'll go way up really fast. I'm going straight up. There we go. Up, 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 up. And there we go. The glider, you can do this as well. Mode two. Do some little spinnies. Go the other way. And come back. Now this glider, last thing I want to say about it is it can travel pretty fast and pretty far at a quick pace. Here we go. I'm going full speed. I'm running on a 3S. You can put a 4S in here and go even faster. But you can see I'm going across the whole park extremely fast. And bring it around. At super fast speed. There we go. And I'm going to kill the motor and I'm just going to let it glide down to the ground. And the last thing to say about gliders is uh, they're one of the few planes that they actually enjoy being flown on a windy day. So if it's too windy to fly a normal plane, fly a glider. There's a pass. I'll bring it around for one more pass. It should have lost enough altitude to come down for a landing. Do a close pass beside me here. Beautiful. All right, let's bring it for a landing. As soon as you go into a nice tight corner like I'm doing here, she burns off speed. So there we go. I can get it to come back to me. I'm bringing the nose up manually and she's coming down. Here we go. Beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful. All right, so this was just me out on a beautiful night in the month of April flying RC planes for some relaxation because I had a free night. So this was pretty good. Thanks for watching this video. I'll put links to both these planes below. You can go check them out. But for now, I say bye.